you. Today's encouraging word comes from Psalm 46 and we'll read verse number 10. And it says, Be still and know that I am God. Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, praise God for Thursday. Joy uh, for the Spirit Day. And uh, praise God for this scripture. It's one of my favorite scriptures. Be still and know that I am God. And, you know, today we don't purpose to stay long in this space. Just want to share something that um, is something that we all know, but we need to be reminded of things. Um, you know, being remembered, uh, or being put in remembrance of things is something that's really important. Uh, Peter, in his uh, epistle, says it repeatedly, that he wants to put us in remembrance of things. Um, and that's what we want to do today, because sometimes we need to recall certain things, certain basic principles. And I believe one of them is the importance of getting still before the Lord. Uh, as it says here, it says, be still and know that I, I am God. And in this crazy, you know, world that we're living in, sometimes we can get caught up in all of the activities that we have going on. And we're racing to and fro. And if we're not literally racing to and fro, then even when we're sitting down, our minds and our hearts are busy racing uh, and sometimes that can even affect our prayers because we'll go before God and we're praying but we're also thinking what we're going to do after we finish praying. You ever been there when you're praying and, you, and it's somewhere in the middle of your prayer you start thinking about the things you have to do after you finish praying um, but God says be still and know that I am God. And so today, the encouragement to us all is to take some time to purposely get into the presence of God and simply quiet your heart and quiet your mind. Don't try to think what God is talking about. Just quiet yourself and allow Him in His time to speak to you, to comfort you, to guide you, and to direct you. And remember what the scripture says, in His presence there is fullness of joy and that's where we want to be we want to be in his presence where there's fullness of joy and at his right hand where there are pleasures evermore but we have the purpose to get there and so today uh, let us all be encouraged to take some time to slow down our lives but most importantly to slow down our hearts slow down our minds get still before God purpose to do it and get into his presence where you can experience the fullness of his joy. It's something that we need to do more of each and every day. God bless you. Until next time, be encouraged and know that Jesus loves you and his love never fails.